beautiful. So today I am giving you guys another portion of my closet declutter series. You guys really like the last one and my makeup declutter, which I will link them both down below, hopefully in a playlist if I remember. Sam, remember that in editing. You guys know I'm getting married next summer and I am trying to clean out my closet, clean out my room in general. I literally have so many bags over here near where I film full of old clothes that I don't wear anymore that I still have yet to have my mom, my sister go through or whatever. And there are also some other areas in my room where I really want to declutter. So if you guys want to see videos on those once my closet is done and please let me know down below we are going to tackle the next part of my closet my closet is so incredibly packed right now like I cannot wait to show you guys my crop top section you guys will like lose your shit like not even kidding right in this little space before my little organizer right here so with that all being said if you guys want to see me declutter I am going to be doing long sleeves and sweaters today and I think I'm gonna save sweatshirts for another video and then of course like I said this little pink organizer thing right here and then of course the top and the bottom and all that but I also have a lot of stuff right here on the ground because I am doing a back-to-school haul within the next few weeks let's just get started so I have quite the collection of long sleeves and sweaters here so the first long sleeve we have is from zoomies and it's just my alien shirt that says I'm just visiting so this is obviously same because I do wear that a lot next we have a plain black long sleeve which I just got recently from Primark this is staying another one this one's just a little bit different called the stretch V and I do wear these too I really like to wear them when I'm working or just in the winter in general so I don't have to wear like a sweatshirt with like a t-shirt underneath or something. Looks a little bit more put together. Speaking of put together, I have a white one so that is staying. Okay, so next, this is a Marona one that I love so much because I just love this pattern. So I do wear this a lot in the summer, in the summer. I wear this a lot in the winter and the fall so this is going to stay. Okay, so next, this one's also relatively new but I haven't worn it in a while. This is from Cabela's. It's just a, it's a pink real tree top. It's all pink real tree on the back and the front is just pink again. I got it from Cabela's It's a large it's supposed to be like a sleep shirt But I wear it as a regular long sleeve shirt So that's gonna stay because I haven't worn it in a while But I do want to a couple thermal tops that I also think I got these from David for Christmas And I do like to wear these so they're gonna stay I have a black thermal and a white thermal They're also really good if you live in like Maine or areas where it gets really 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 cold like Canada you can layer underneath your clothes Which is what my mom used to make me do and I hate it it fun fact one from pink which is a little bit run down but I do still wear it I'm gonna keep this one and another pink thermal this is actually one of the ones that fits me because I've had a couple not last year the year before that were really really tight on me which is really odd they like played up the different sizing I guess I don't know they made them a lot tighter but I just really love this one a lot it's very subtle with the love pink all over it really Christmassy and I'm gonna keep it because I do wear it around Christmas time I'm warning you guys right now a lot of the plain ones I am keeping because I wear them quite often and I can wear them with a lot of different things so if you're wondering why I'm like not getting rid of any of these that's why I have a couple more long sleeves here's another Morona one it's like a Heather gray color and then this is a Mossimo one these are like my favorite I love these ones the Morona ones from Target are really good too but I really love the Mossimo because it just like slims you out and like gives you emphasis to your boobs I don't know maybe it's just me but I really like that so keeping that oh my god I haven't seen this in forever see this is why I have to clean out my closet I have this I don't even know if you want to call it a long sleeve because it has like a funnel neck to it but it just says need more coffee. This is staying but I think this has to go in like my sweater category. Because actually maybe not. I don't know. I don't know. It's got like a funnel neck thing on it but it's long sleeve. I don't know. Let me know below what you guys think I should do with that one. I think I'm just going to keep it with the long sleeves. No, that was actually connected to this top I got from Maine and I ended up cutting it so I could wear it off the shoulder but honestly you guys I don't wear this one at all and I kind of ruined the back of it a little bit. For those reasons I think I am going to part with it just because I fucked it up and I feel really bad about it because I spent so much money on tourist stuff which speaking of here's another one of the similar style this is from pink it's one of their varsity crews guys this was originally like 80 bucks and I think I got it for maybe 40 which is still a lot for what this is it's just a huge long sleeve top basically and it's got sequins over here sequins all down the sleeve it's so cute I really like it but I just don't honestly wear it enough so I think I am gonna part with it and it's kind of got like it's a little bit stained I don't know why maybe for makeup I think you are gonna go bye bye word of advice if you are young don't spend all your money on expensive of clothes because you will regret it later let me tell you oh this was from Christmas time it's a little pink nation shirt I did wear this one time I believe I'm not sure I think I did wear this it just says pink nation 
information. It's all the way down the sleeve right here and same on this side. So I am going to keep this for Christmas and if I don't wear it, then I'm just going to get rid of it. And then next we have one, yes, one of my Tana Mosho shirts. I have three of her shirts and one of her posters and her phone case because I'm insane. Hi. I'm probably one of the very few people in the world that like Tana Mosho still, but I don't really care. I love her and Gabby and all of them, so you know what, whatever. I like Ashley too. Ashley Swan, I love her. But this is only one of them because the other one's actually over there. So some of my clothes you guys are probably not going to see because some are dirty, some are just here waiting to get put away. This one says I hate myself because that's like my life. <laughs> this is staying because these were really expensive. This was my Christmas present from David. If you guys know the whole like drama behind getting some of her merch, basically they lost my package and then found it and I didn't get them till after Christmas. I placed the order on Black Friday. No tea, no shade though, like the company that does Tana's merch is awesome. They were very great and very supportive to me with customer service, so. No tea, no shade, they were really awesome, but that just really, really sucked. <laughs> Next we have my Atlantic City, New Jersey top. I don't think I've ever worn this that much, and it's just really huge on me. I, I haven't worn it enough, it just says Atlantic City, New Jersey. I got it made. Hmm, I don't really know if I'm gonna keep this or not. I think I'm gonna put it in the I don't know, because I wanna keep it because like I don't think I'm gonna go to Atlantic City again for a very long time. It's been a few years now since I've been there. Ooh, it's one of these flowy tops you guys know I was like so obsessed with with wearing bralettes underneath it It's from pink it just says pink right here, but it's really subtle and on the back It has like a cutout sort of deal going on put my hand under there you guys can see it's really cute and flowy So I'm keeping that and Then we just have another one of those sort of lo oh hello this is just another one of those really flowy long sleeve shirts. It's a v-neck from pink, so I'm keeping those because I like to wear bralettes, like I said, underneath them. It'd be really comfy and chill. Okay, so next we just have another one from pink. This is probably one of the oldest pink tops I own. It's just this thermally one, and it's all oversized, so I'm keeping this because I do wear it on occasion. And then I have, I don't even know what you want to call this. It's kind of a weird top because the sleeves are really tight around my arms. It's like one of those tops, but it's very loose, so I, I don't know why it's in the long sleeve I guess it's because it kind of is a long sleeve not sure but I got this shirt from Target and it says coffee please on the pocket right here it's just very loose and flowy I think I am going to keep this because I haven't worn it enough I just don't know where it's going to go so I'm going to put it in the I don't know slash I'm keeping it oh, no. here we have oh hello oh my hello oh hello there dear another one of these giant flowy tops that I really like to wear like I said this one's just maroon and it has the pink emblem on there a lot of the stuff's like relatively new too so that's why it's like I'm not getting rid of anything okay so here's one I have two of these Massimo sweater croppy kind of shirts that I like to wear in the fall in the winter time just because they're like a little bit thicker than a normal shirt but not as much as a sweater and they're just really cute and they're really croppy I could wear it with leggings and stuff I'm gonna keep both of them and they look nice with everything so I could dress it up dress it down oh gosh we're getting into the hard stuff now this lacy top which I've held on to for years and years and years like if you guys go all the way back like some of my earlier hauls I think I hauled this and I've worn it a few times I wore it in a video and stuff and I kind of want to keep it so I could make it into like a crop top or something I don't know so I think this is going to be the I don't know pile because I want to keep it but I don't wear it but I want to change it into something else. Princess Beer Wang. I think I got this from Kohl's. This is one of the only nice tops that I own. I haven't worn it in a very long time though. And it's like all galaxy. There's like all these different things on there. There's a dragonfly, comets, galaxies. Just a whole like mosh posh of things actually. I don't even know what half of this stuff is. It looks like a mutant Patrick Star right there. Legitimately Patrick Star from Spongebob. So no one come for me. There's a lipstick on there. But it's just really, really cute. So I think I'm going to keep it because I don't have a lot of dressy clothes wear for like nice and fancy things and I know this is kind of like a weird shirt that I would wear but I am gonna keep you oh there's no way in hell any of my alien stuff is automatically off limits <laughs> I have this spaced out top from H&M that I love so much because it just says spaced out and of course there's like galaxies and moons and stars all over it and you guys know I consider myself an alien I love aliens and UFOs so that's why I have a lot of clothes with aliens on them if you're wondering if you're like why the hell is this bitch obsessed with aliens that's why so these two I'm definitely not getting rid of because I do wear them in the fall this one is just a flannel kind of it's not really flannel it's like a mock flannel and on the back it just has some lace as you guys can see it's really cute to wear in the fall time so I'm keeping that and then this is more of like a real flannel I ended up getting it from Aeropostale really comfy and cute throw on so that's staying with me oh this is gonna be the hard part so this is really really hard because I've had this one from Walmart for years and I kind of don't want to get rid of it but I have this big one from Target that I could easily turn it into I don't know I'm keeping them I don't care what you say I don't know pile 
I don't know. Actually, I am going to keep the Target one because I just bought that. But this one has been around forever. Guys, again, remember my first videos. I've had this top for years. <sighs> I don't know. I have to think about you. Okay, so now we are finally getting into the sweater portion. I feel like I don't have a lot of sweaters. It's mostly cardigans. But first cardigans, I have a couple from Target. This is just a plain black one. I like to wear these when I was student teaching, when I'm working with kids and stuff like that. Just because it's something easy to throw on and take off if I get hot. So that is staying. Then. I oh my gosh I bought this Christmas one so this is like my Christmas sweater I have to keep this just so cute it's got candy canes and wreaths on it and there's a snowman it's like not like a traditional Christmas sweater it's like it's a little bit different which I really like and I like the inside of it I feel like they should just make a sweater of this I would totally wear that oh we're getting into the pattern ones you guys so this one I also got from Target and I'm really obsessed with it because it's just so weird and different and I just love the black and white contrast with it and everything I think I'm gonna keep this because I just bought it last year this is gonna stay with me this one from Derek Hart that I got from Mickey Finn's which is a store here that sells like Levi Ed Hardy it just sells like all the name brands but they're like really really expensive I ended up picking up this cardigan and I really liked it a lot it's just like pink it's got geometric patterns in it however I don't really wear it that much it's gonna be hard to part with you because I kind of want to part with it but I'm not sure if I should or not I don't know what to do with you that's I don't know pile this cardigan I got from Walmart oh hello from Walmart last year I believe and it's just really cute again with like the geometric pattern it's a really really long one too so I think this one's gonna stay with me a little while longer and I just like that a lot of cardigans they're like black white or gray so just so they can go with everything hello did I tell you to come out no I did not you I just recently got this cardigan back from my mom because I bought this and she like borrowed it and never gave it back but I have this white and gray one that I just got last year so I'm definitely keeping it it's a lot more heavier of a material kind of like the black and white geometric one I showed you guys so I'm gonna keep it and I think it's gonna be great for like Christmas too because it just reminds me of like a wintry Christmas sweater if you get what I mean the gray version of that black one from Target so that's staying with me all these are relatively new that's why I'm kind of like I'm not getting rid of them and then I have one here from H&M I think this was on clearance too and it's just so warm and comfortable and it's long and just I'm obsessed I'm obsessed so you're staying with me two of these like sweater sweatshirts and I do wear them sometimes and sometimes I don't I feel like it depends for me I just recently got this one back too and I haven't worn it yet oh I don't know what to do with these I want to keep them because they kind of go with things and I could just throw them on I don't know pile oh no, yes I just bought this a few months ago so this is not going anywhere I got this really nice cute sweater by the Mossimo brand fun fact apparently Target is getting rid of Morona and Mossimo and they're gonna replace it with all new brands or something you didn't hear from me but that's what i heard through the grapevine so i'm kind of sad i really love the sweater a lot it's really nice and flowy in this area especially if you're not feeling the best ladies and it has like a cute little tie so this is staying because it's staying and that's final same with this one i just got it for christmas this year it's my alien sweater from forever 21 men actually that david got me and that i love so so much and i love to wear it and it's just so cute and it's me so i'm keeping it and i don't care what any of y'all say so the last couple ones we have here this is is the Harley Quinn Daddy's Little Monster sweater and I love it so much I got it on sale I believe maybe I'm wrong I can't remember but it's so cute and I love Harley Quinn I still love Harley Quinn even now that Suicide Squad is over I don't care so this is staying with me anything Harley Quinn like is mine so the last thing in here is actually from Banana Republic I got this sweater and I really liked it because it was just like stars on it. it was just plain and cute and I got it at the outlets when I went with Danielle when she had to buy work clothes a couple years ago however I don't wear this enough honestly you no know, I, I just don't wear it enough so I think this is gonna have to go bye bye one bonus item one bonus item the sweatshirt I cut up and made a mess out of I did a whole video on this so I'll link it down below it's supposed to be like a cute like cut up sweatshirt and it just looks really bad so I think I might have to pass this along there's a lot of stuff I'm seeing in here now that I'm like oh yeah I have that it's also kind of nice to see it so now I'm gonna go through the maybes that I might be getting rid of and again I know I didn't get rid of a lot of clothes like the last video it's just very hard very hard for me personally so I apologize for that at least I got rid of some things and I didn't keep everything you know what I mean these two sweaters I think I am going to pass them along because I could easily just wear a sweatshirt if I want to go out or something and if I need anything like this again I'm sure I could just borrow it from my mom or buy another one but I just don't wear these so they are gonna go bye bye same with this cardigan I love it so much so so much and I'm very sad that I 
didn't really wear it that much, honestly. Same with this cardigan. I love it. I really do, but I just don't wear it enough. Honestly, I really don't, so bye-bye. Finally, this, I think, very worn down now. I'm just going to pass it along. Okay, I'm still going to keep this only because I want to try and make it into a crop top or like wear it as a crop top and if it doesn't work out then I'm just going to get rid of it. The Atlantic City. Oh gosh, I want to keep this though. I really do. I really want to keep this. I think for now this is going to stay with me only because I don't have a lot of Atlantic City merch. I think I did a pretty good job getting rid of some things. I didn't think I would get rid of that much but I thought I would get rid of more. But that was my second closet declutter video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and it helped you in some way and inspired you to clean out your shit because face it we all have a lot of shit we all have to get rid of it i have to say after this haul that i'm going to be doing for you guys i'm going to really try not to buy clothes anymore can't say the same for makeup but i'm going to really try not buy any more clothes because my closet is just like saying help me right now especially this side like help me help me sam help me it's, it's so bad so so bad so if you guys want to see more of these videos be sure to like this video and let me know down below it, what part of my closet should I do next should I do sweatshirt should I do this organizational thing with all my scarves and my sleep shirts and my gym tank tops my camis or or should we tackle the monster that is my crop top section so just let me know down below and that will be the next one like I said I think these are gonna go up pretty monthly or one every one to two months just so I don't like get you guys really bored with it or anything like that but yeah so I love you guys so much hope you have an awesome day subscribe if you'd like to see more of me and like this video if you enjoyed, like I said. And I'm not sure where videos are coming out next week, but I'm going to be pre-filming because, as you guys know, my friend Nate is coming down for a few days. So there may be one video that week. I'm not quite sure yet, but I will let you guys know. So I love you guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. I'm so out of shape. So out of shape. I can't breathe when I talk. No, I just talk too much. That's it. I just talk too much. It's fine. <laughs> I think it's time to practice what